What's up YouTube, this is Cody here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you guys the new and redesigned App Store app. So if we jump into the App Store here, you'll see that everything has that iOS 7 look and feel. And a new feature that I want to show you guys is the wish list. So if we tap on an app that costs money, you'll see that the share button up there in the top right. If we tap on that, you'll have an option to either share it, gift it, or add it to your wish list. So now if we just add it to our wish list, and then you can access your wish list by tapping that button to the right of the share button up in the top right hand corner. And there you can see the app. You also have a new feature called Near Me, which you'll see in the center of the toolbar at the bottom. Now if you tap on that, it's going to show popular apps in the area that you're in, and you can download those apps straight from that screen. The App Store is also getting a new kids category which showcases the best apps for children based on their age, but it hasn't rolled out just yet, so we should see it coming in a future update. Also a minor update is if you perform a search, so if I just tap here and type in college, you'll see the number of results in the right of the search bar right here. Now another nice thing that the App Store has implemented is they've enabled automatic updates for your apps. So when an update is available, it's going to update without you having to go into the App Store and doing it manually. Now Apple says it will intelligently schedule updates during power efficient times, such as when your device is on and connected to Wi-Fi to ensure that it doesn't impact battery life. Now if you want to toggle automatic updates on or off, just jump into the settings here, scroll down to iTunes and App Store, and here you can turn off or on your automatic downloads for your music, apps, and updates. Also if we jump back to the features tab here and we scroll all the way down there is a redeem button and if you tap on redeem then you can actually take a picture of your gift card using the camera and it's going to update onto your Apple ID. Now you can do this in the iTunes app as well. So what do you guys think about the new features of the App Store? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to check out more of my iOS 7 videos, then go ahead and subscribe. Alright guys, until next time, this is Cody with iPhoneHacks.com.